Imagine a language that is older than the pyramids, yet more precise than modern computer code. A language that not only birthed civilizations, but now holds the key to the future of artificial intelligence and advanced science. This language, Sanskrit, has been called the language of the gods, and for good reason. But what if I told you that Sanskrit is far more than just a language of religious texts? That it's poised to transform modern science, computing, and even how we understand the human brain? Stay tuned, because by the end of this video, you'll see why Sanskrit is far from dead. In fact, it's more alive than ever. If you skip this, you'll miss learning why NASA, Silicon Valley, and top universities around the world are taking a renewed interest in this ancient language. Could this dead language be the future of modern innovation? Trust me, you don't want to miss this. Welcome to the channel Universal Insights. Let's start with a simple yet mind-blowing fact. NASA, the world's leader in space exploration, has recognized the potential of Sanskrit. In 1985, a research paper titled Knowledge Representation in Sanskrit and Artificial Intelligence proposed that Sanskrit's linguistic structure could be the best framework for developing AI languages. Why? Because Sanskrit is the only language in the world that is not ambiguous. Every word has one, and only one, meaning. Think about that for a second. In a world full of ambiguity and complexity, Sanskrit offers precision like no other. Here's another staggering fact. According to Rick Briggs, a NASA researcher, Sanskrit's grammatical structure is so mathematically perfect that it can be directly implemented into machine language, an astounding feat for a language that's over 3,500 years old. But it's not just NASA that's fascinated by Sanskrit. Top universities in the West, like Oxford, Harvard, and even MIT, have Sanskrit courses that are not merely about studying ancient texts, but about exploring the language's potential in modern science, philosophy, and cognitive development. Here's a unique fact. Dr. J.F. Stahl, a renowned linguist from the University of California, stated that Sanskrit, due to its highly structured grammar, holds the key to unlocking the mysteries of language and consciousness. According to him, the brain's understanding of language might one day be explained by studying the intricate rules of Sanskrit. In fact, recent cognitive research backs this up. Sanskrit is known for its incredible precision and structure. It has a complex grammar system that allows for the creation of highly nuanced and expressive sentences. A 2017 study published by Dr. James Hartzell revealed that learning Sanskrit rewires your brain. His study on Sanskrit students showed an increase in gray matter the part of the brain responsible for memory, attention, and cognitive control. The takeaway? Sanskrit doesn't just enrich your understanding of language, it physically alters and enhances your brain. No wonder it's been called the yoga of the mind. Sanskrit boasts a vast vocabulary with estimates suggesting millions of words. This makes it one of the richest languages in the world. Now here's where it gets even more fascinating. The recitation of Sanskrit mantras, particularly those from ancient texts like the Vedas, has been shown to affect the brain at a vibrational level. According to research by Dr. David Frawley, the resonant frequencies generated by Sanskrit chants can calm the nervous system, improve focus, and even induce a meditative state in the practitioner. This is why Sanskrit mantras are often recommended in mindfulness practices worldwide. But Sanskrit's reach doesn't end there. Sanskrit is often referred to as the mother of all languages, and for good reason. It's the root of many modern languages spoken across South Asia, including Hindi, Bengali, and Marathi. But Sanskrit is much more than just a linguistic ancestor. It's a treasure trove of literature, philosophy, and scientific knowledge. Did you know that Sanskrit is the root language for over 1,200 languages, including many modern European languages? The influence of Sanskrit extends far beyond South Asia. Its influence on English, German, Russian, and even Spanish is well documented. Many words in English, French, and German have Sanskrit roots. For instance, the words Deva, God, Karma, Action, and Nirvana, Enlightenment, all come from Sanskrit. Sir William Jones, a British philologist, made this famous statement in the 18th century, the mother of Europe's languages, recognizing the deep connection between Sanskrit and European languages. German philosopher Arthur Schopenhauer said Sanskrit is a perfect language. He was impressed by the language's structure and logic. Because of how intertwined these languages are, knowing Sanskrit gives you an edge when learning many other languages. Heinrich Zimmer, a German Indologist, believed that Sanskrit offered a window into the cultural and intellectual history of humanity. He said the study of Sanskrit is the key to the understanding of humankind. Now let's talk about something that's not often discussed, philosophy and mathematics. 
Western philosophers like Schopenhauer and Nietzsche were deeply influenced by Sanskrit texts, particularly the Upanishads. Schopenhauer even called the Upanishads the most rewarding and elevating reading in the world, and it's not just philosophy. Sanskrit texts like the Sulba Sutras contain advanced mathematical concepts, including what we now call the Pythagorean theorem, centuries before Pythagoras himself. In these texts, we find detailed algorithms for constructing complex altars and calculating precise measurements, showcasing the advanced mathematical knowledge of ancient India. Today, researchers are taking a new look at these ancient texts, and the results are astonishing. There's ongoing work exploring how Sanskrit can contribute to the fields of quantum computing and cryptography. Sanskrit's precision and non-ambiguity make it a powerful tool for encoding information securely, which is exactly what's needed in today's digital world. Remember, this ancient language isn't just for historians or spiritual seekers. There's a new wave of interest from the tech community, scientists and even cognitive researchers who believe that Sanskrit could unlock the future of everything from artificial intelligence to neuroscience. Sanskrit is shrouded in a bit of mystery. Unlike other ancient languages, its origins aren't entirely clear. Historians believe it emerged around 1500 BC in northern India. What we do know is that Sanskrit was primarily a spoken language for centuries before it was ever written down. This means there's a whole era of Sanskrit literature that's lost to time. Learning Sanskrit today is easier than ever with modern tools and apps. In fact, some of the latest AI learning platforms are even incorporating Sanskrit into their code structures for faster, more efficient algorithms. But before we wrap up, let's not forget the spiritual and philosophical depth that Sanskrit holds. Whether it's the wisdom of the Bhagavad Gita, the spiritual insights of the Upanishads, or the sacred chants of the Rig Veda, Sanskrit is a treasure trove of ancient wisdom that continues to inspire thinkers, scientists, and seekers alike. So what do you think? Is Sanskrit truly the language of the future? Leave a comment below and let us know. We may not respond, but we read every comment. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on more incredible insights into the hidden treasures of science and spirituality. Thanks for watching. And remember, Sanskrit isn't just an ancient relic. It's a living, breathing force that could shape the future of humanity.